Right, it's almost time. I know, I'm actually feeling a bit nervous. Oh, yeah, me too. I'm wondering if this is what Lady Gaga will go through before a gig. <laughs> yeah, she probably phones up one of her famous mates and is like, I can't do this, Mary. And she's like, you can do it. Who's Mary? Mary Nightingale, the uh, news presenter. I mean, all famous people know each other. Do they? Right, let's do this. Sell, sell, sell. Got the password. Um, 51132. That's well remembered. Okay, I'm going to tell me to rumble. Well, I bet Gaga says that to Mary. Oh, be. Have we not had any breakfast? No, not time. Oh, Do I have a collar? I see what you mean. <laughs> Who is that? Wait, go get him before she comes on. Oh, hey. Hello, Mrs. Bell. No, no, don't do that, please. What are you playing at? That is wicked, Kirk. I sound the horn whenever we make a sale. It's an incentive. <laughs> nice one, mate. I feel super incentivised. Right, well, we're in the middle of a really important meeting, me and Carla. We just need peace and quiet. Have you got that? So sorry, Mrs Barlow. Oh, please don't call me that. Is it not your name? <sighs> right, just no horn, Kirk, OK? OK. Oh! It was an accident, Mrs Barlow. Sorry, Mrs Barlow. Alrighty then, Rovers. I've still got work to do. <sighs> I swear, I am going to shove that right up his... Ah! You sure you don't want to come? No, but um, I do fancy going out for a meal after work. Me and you? It's not a date. You know, I just fancy something to eat and you're the nearest available person. Well, since you put it like that, OK. Sorry. I know I said it wouldn't happen again, but it's lunchtime. Couldn't resist. I've got a question. How many times can you wear a pair of jeans before you have to wash them? And you wonder why you're single. Hello? Is there anybody there? No, it's got a motion sensor. It's lavender and lemon. It's a very relaxing fragrance. Smell the lemons. You'll be getting a kick in your lemons. 